Hello everyone. Thank you for watching today's video. This is very special video for me as well as you guys. Every day now and then I receive so many questions and I know that my viewers like you would like to know more about me. And I thought why should not I create a video about the questions which you are, you have in your mind. I would like to answer those. We have our friend Bruce. Thank you Bruce for joining. Thank you Sandeep. I think we should start. Okay. So Sandeep, uh, what inspired you initially to make these YouTube videos? Oh, that's a very interesting question. I would say uh, due to lack of study materials on the internet, my colleagues, friends and I faced some tough times to learn the technologies. Whatever material was available was either incomplete or not informative. Yeah, that is true fact. Therefore, I decided that none of us should encounter such a problem. It is, a, it is the main inspiration behind making these YouTube videos. I make these videos and post on the YouTube channel to help others. Sandeep, your YouTube videos have become quite popular. How do you feel about creating more than 500 YouTube videos which have had more than 1 million views? Oh, I never imagined it. It is very gratifying to see that my videos have been viewed a multitude of times by so many viewers. And they are still going on. I never envisioned creating so many videos. These are a lot of videos, 500 I think. I really surprised by looking at those numbers. These are very sad and it eventually become a satisfactory hobby which helps others too. Your videos really are very creative. What do you like the most about making these YouTube videos? Oh, it is very exhaustive process, Bruce. Uh, despite a large amount of my time and effort to make YouTube videos, I truly enjoy the entire process. This process involves so many things such as gathering content presented in viewer-friendly way and posting it on YouTube videos are fun. I especially enjoy recording the video, the one which I am doing right now. The reason is, I, I feel like I am conversing with my audience. Even though they are not physically present here, I can almost sense my viewers' reaction and their, their presence. Audience feedback is very welcome. Sandeep, you've said that you enjoy receiving viewers' comments. How do you react to constructive criticism from your viewers? Yeah, I just said like, uh, I, I like the audience feedback. Viewer comments give me idea for new and better videos on the technical topics. Sometimes I create the non-technical topics also, such as requirement gathering. I realize that my verbal communication and presentation skill aren't perfect. Making these videos helps me to improve my skill sets. Despite their imperfections, my videos got very positive comments from viewers, which are appreciated. And this is one of the important factor which motivates me to continue video production. The internet really has made our world very much a global community. Other than the United States, people in what other countries have seen your work? Oh, this is very, very interesting. Um, initially, I was thinking the viewers are, are from only United States. It is amazing to see the impact of my videos. It's not, it, it's so many different countries of the world. This includes my motherland, India, and the other countries such as United, uh, United States, uh, Australia, France, China, United Kingdom. Germany, Spain, and many other countries from Latin America. I especially pleases, actually it pleases me to see viewers comments about my videos in their native language, such as if you see one of, few of my videos got the comments from Russian language, some of them are from Spanish and some of them from Arabic language. So even I don't understand those languages, I just convert those into uh, um, English on Google Translator and it's really amazing to see those their comments. Sandeep, your videos really have covered a diverse range of uh, 
technical topics. How do you select a YouTube video topic? Hmm, that is a tough job actually, but my audience helps me. Many of my videos deal with the general technology concept of interest to my viewers and me. Based on viewers' requests, I often start adding new topics. Actually, they recommend, they ask some questions and that is the starting, for, starting point for the choosing the topic, which resolves conceptual as well as theoretical problems. If you see my past videos, which have dealt with issues pertaining of Informatica Master Data Management, which is a leading tool in the current market, Hadoop, Java, Spring Boot, Data Modeling, and of course the one which I love is the Informatica Data Director, JavaScript, ClickSense, and many others. And I think, Bruce, I would recommend you should go through this technical topic you will enjoy that too. Maybe I will, Cindy. Tell me about your uh, typical YouTube audience. You really attract a diverse range of viewers. Oh yeah, um, that's that's again another interesting uh, question. I would say uh, I never imagined my YouTube videos will be viewed by this uh, type of audience. My audience or my YouTube videos are not typical but actually very diverse demographic, de demographically. The age ranges from early 20s to late 70s with approximately half female and half male. As mentioned already, my audience comes from all over the world. Reflecting diversity of language and the culture, I often receive emails, text messages and phone calls from viewers seeking solution to technical issues and clarification of various questions or the, the points they have that in mind. A recent text message I received just morning, they are asking about the technical problem. Really? Wow. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. So Sandeep, what are your YouTube plans for the future? You've already accomplished a lot. What do you want to do now? I think I'm still not satisfied with my uh, my performance on YouTube. So there are some plans. In addition to continue YouTube video productions, I have several plans. It is my hope to eventually launch a blogger to provide more elaborative information about technical topics. And this is uh, one of the requests which I got from my YouTube viewer. They would like to see me on blogger. So I have some plans around that. I also aspire to go live on YouTube stream to answer viewers' questions and discuss emerging topics in the world of information technology. So all my viewers, I would like to see you on my live stream very soon. Sandeep, you're really a very interesting guy. Besides um, making YouTube videos, what are your other hobbies? Oh, uh, I think um, I never mentioned to anyone about my hobbies and I think this is the right forum where I would like to say I love to travel. Travel is my passion and I recently visited Cusco and the ruins of Machu Picchu in Peru country. Outdoor hiking and camping, also running and definitely the oil painting are also favorite pastimes who will not love the spending time with family. Spending quality time with my friends and family is also extremely important to me. So Sandeep, in summary, is there anything more that you'd like to say? I think I said everything what I would like to say. Finally, just few words from me. I would like to thank all of my YouTube viewers, my well-wishers, my friends, and my beloved who support my work. Please keep watching my videos and provide recommendation and comment for improvement. Your support is very much appreciated. Thank you again and have a great time. Thank you Bruce for joining today's interview. Thank you Cindy. It was a pleasure. It was really a pleasure. Thank you again. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.